welcome back to another video. It has only been five days since my last video, but we're gonna jump right back on schedule. And um, today is Tuesday, March 20th. I am officially 14 weeks post-op today. And um, if you are new here, my name is Anna. 22, I'm 5'5. I had a vertical sleeve gastrectomy December 12th, 2017. Um, and if you don't know what that is, that is a type of weight loss surgery. So, um, today's video is probably not going to be as long as other videos because I don't have much to update you guys on. Um, just like a few key things here. So, when I got back from my trip and I weighed myself on Thursday instead of on Tuesday, I was 215. Today I weighed in at 213.2. So I lost 1.8 pounds in five days. Um, and then, yeah, that's it. I haven't taken measurements in a while. Um, and I really haven't taken before or after photos in a while either. One thing that if you guys haven't noticed, I chopped off all my hair. Yes, I did. It is phenomenal. I'm so glad I did it. I always do this thing where I grow out my hair to about here and then I chop it all off to about here. So I'm really happy with it. I think I'm just going to keep it short from now on. I just feel like the most like myself and I think that it like this length just suits my face shape really well. I don't know, you guys can comment down below and let me know. But I cut off 11 inches, she said, and the only reason I couldn't donate it is because my hair has been dyed and dyed and dyed again. So, and that person just cut me off, I'm really glad. Um, so, that's something I did from last video to now. Um, I really did not, I shouldn't say I ate like absolutely terrible, but I also did not eat like 100% on track. I've noticed since surgery that my period cravings are like way more intense than they have ever been before. Like, I've never experienced something like this. Um, so I was like craving everything last week. And I wasn't sure why, and then my period hit me, and then it all made sense. And I did give in to some of the cravings, not even gonna lie. For example, I was craving like cheesy things, like I was craving Cheez Its, and randomly I was craving um, cheddar cheese combos, which, like, such a weird craving. I haven't had combos in probably like five years, and I, I don't know gave into both of them though um but you know it's it is what it is um and then Sunday yesterday and today I've been like totally fine one thing that was kind of major that I did this weekend was I drank alcohol for the first time in four months uh so I was a little bit nervous to see how that was going to play out um, and I, I asked around, or like I was kind of like looking online to see how long other people waited. Train tracks, hold on. So, um, I was like reaching out to a few people and like seeing how long other people waited, like doing the math. And the, most people waited like at least three months and then some waited, you know, six months, some waited even longer than that. So... I decided I'm in college, I am, this is my last semester of school, and so I was going to at least wait three months, which is kind of the minimum, but, um, you know, like, just trying to live my life. I'm by no means a huge partier, but I also want to have fun on my, like, during my last semester. Not that you can't have fun without alcohol, because you can, but um, I decided to go out with my friends for St. Patrick's Day never gone out for St. Patrick's Day before, and it was a blast, not even gonna lie. Um, I drank, I probably drank like half of a drink an hour, if that makes sense, and they were big drinks. They were like um, plastic cups type thing. 
So, uh, we were there for eight hours. So I probably had like four drinks, like four ish. Um, it's a little blurry there at the end, but, and then I also sipped a apple pie shot just because it tasted really good. So I sipped on it and then, um, that was it for that. And I mean, by the end of the night, I was obviously drunk, but I was like, <laughs> for all of those out there who do drink for fun, um, I was like the perfect drunk, you know what I mean? Like, I was drunk for sure and couldn't, I wouldn't be able to drive a car, but I wasn't like to the point of like blacking out or like feeling sick. I was just like having a great old time, like just being super obnoxious and stuff. So that was Saturday and I'm glad it went as well as it did, you know, because I was pretty nervous about how alcohol is going to affect me because I was already like kind of a lightweight before. So lightweight plus VSG, you know, like weird mix. Um, so that was Saturday and that's also kind of plays into why I was, wasn't eating the best because when we got home from the bar is when I was eating most of the Cheez-Its and combos that I had bought. So, you know, drunken shenanigans. Um, but yeah, it was fun. And since then, I've been like totally on track. I've been trying to post more um, on my Veggie VSG Instagram. Oh, also about St. Patrick's Day, a non-scale victory. I wore a size large um, shirt from Five Below. It was a men's large, but before I would have been like a men's 2XL to a 3XL. Like, no joke. So I was in a men's large shirt, and I was in a one size fits all tutu. It was a little tight, not even gonna lie, but I fit into it, and that's what matters. Actually, it doesn't matter, but it was cool. You know, like I couldn't have even told you the last time that I fit into anything like that, you know? Um, but yeah, guys, that's going to be the end of this video. I'm sorry. It's a little bit shorter this week. Overall, it was like a decent week, especially for not really exercising. And today's my first day back at school. So, um, since like the school week started, I've been back on track yesterday. I went to Zumba today. I'm going to at least two classes possibly three if I have the time so yeah everything's been good and um I will talk to you guys next week at week 15 isn't that crazy hey maybe by maybe by next week I'll be at 210 you never know I just gotta kick myself in the butt then today but I think, or this week, but I think I can do it, guys. So I will talk to you next time now that I'm in the gravel here at school. Um, but yeah, thank you so much for watching, and I will talk to you next time. Peace.